Oh, it occurs to me that some of you have been deprived, robbed, one might say, of a particular influence in their lives. The influence, the wisdom that comes from a slightly older, uh, transient uncle type figure. Now, not everybody has like a um, questionable uncle to impart upon them important life advice. So allow me, permit me, kind sirs, madams, scholars, friends, to be that influence. Some, I'll bet some people call it negative, that influence in your life. So today, allow me to impart some of my foolish wisdom upon you, so that you can be better in tuned with the elements in the forest, and, you know, something else that sounds profound but really isn't. All right, so today, I'm going to tell you about the pre-curry queue. Oh, by the way, I'm Linwood. Nice to meet you. So you might be saying, Uncle Linwood, what is the pre-curry queue? I've never heard of such a thing. Did you make it up? I could have, but no, not in this place. I hadn't made it up. See, if you ever see a dog, you some, you see, that's an airplane, and they're very obnoxious and very... You see, they don't have uncle figures in their lives to impart knowledge. They, so that's why they don't know manners. That's why they always got to keep interrupting me when I am trying to educate an entire generation on the forgotten lore of the Lumberwoods. So first, okay, we, we can stop that. Switch my key. All right. So first, you ever see a dog out at night and you'll see that dog, it'll be barking at something, you know, woo, 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 or whatever. You, Depending on what type dog you have. Actually, let me get my dog. Lucky! Lucky, come on. Lucky, we're talking about you. Come on. Up. Lucky, come on. Up, 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 up. You're making me look bad, dog. So this is Lucky. So, so this is Lucky, and he's a part of this, okay? He's a good boy. He's mostly Harrier Hound. But, and a little bit of uh, terrier has a funny looking towel. Okay, so here's how it goes. Here's how it goes. So it'll be night, and the dog will be barking at something. And you don't know quite what this dog is barking at. So what do most people do? Most people just assume that they are nuts. But no, this magnificent creature here, what is going on? It's seeing something. It's seen something unbeknownst to human eyes. He didn't want his tummy rub. So, dogs can see out and hear a lot more than we can. And truth has it, the reason they're barking out at seemingly nothing at night is because of the pre curry cue. Now, pre curry cue are these little birds or bugs or bug birds that fly around at night. And we don't quite know if their sound is distressing to the sensitive ears of our canine fellows here. Or if there's a particular scent that they put off that drives them wild. But basically, they're just flying out. And you can't see them. And you may not say that they are there, but they are there. And that is the pre-curry cue. So if you have a dog that is barking at night, before you call him nuts or crazy, just know that this creature here is trying to protect you from the pre-curry cue. Good boy.